some very very lazy vegan recipes I've made a few videos like this in the past but these are going to be even more simple because you've said to me we need it more lazy we need it more simple I'm a student I'm a beginner I don't like cooking so these are for you if you are one of those people so we've got five recipes today they're all linked in the description on my website and I also have an ebook with over 100 recipes if you want to check that out for more and let's get into it it's funny. not as warm and melty as it once was because we've been taking pictures of it but mm. that's so yum tastes like pizza obviously you can use whatever bread you have you could use pita bread you could use normal bread and make a toasty it's just kind of like a way of having pizza even if you don't have a pizza in your freezer because usually you can't find vegan pizza very easily so if you don't have access to any nice vegan cheese I've used the one from Tesco it's my favorite the mature cheddar you can just use nutritional yeast to kind of get that cheesy flavour and it'll work as a good alternative. The second way of doing this is making it into a wrap. So if you're feeling uber lazy and you can't even be bothered to make a pizza looking nice thing, you can just shove it all in a wrap, put whatever you want in there and then put it in a toaster machine and voila. That's so good. So much cheese. Cheese. <laughs> I made a slight error. I was supposed to bring the liquid to a boil first. I just chucked the pasta on in without thinking. So bring all the liquid to a boil first and then put the pasta in. They belong to another 
These are the Linda McCartney rosemary and onion sausages. They are very good. Mm -mm -mm. So some of you might be wondering why I put the garlic cloves in their hole. They will infuse everything with a nice garlicky flavour and they are delicious to eat on their own. Just squeeze that out, squeeze it out of the, the skin. Mmm, so good. Honestly, my favourite way to eat garlic. With this stew or kind of chili, you can cook this for up to like an hour, but if you're feeling lazy, you can just eat it as soon as it's hot. It won't taste as good as if you stew it, hence the name, but realistically, a lot of the time, you're just hungry, you don't want to wait, and you want to just eat it, and then you can just leave the leftovers in the fridge, and the next day they will taste a lot better. So I've just shoved the spinach in now, and I'll serve it up with some crusty bread. Mm. that's so comforting we're really good with some bread and like I said you can cook it for way longer and it'll just taste better the longer you cook it also I feel like sweet potato would be really good in this but yeah super simple super yummy hope you enjoy all of these recipes let me know if you cook any and tag me on Instagram I love seeing your pictures don't forget to look at the description for links to all the recipes on my website and I'll see you in my next one Bye. If you're not lucky enough to have Tesco own brand cheese, then I feel sorry for you. <laughs> <laughs> what I sounded like a weirdo. Perfect with some. Mm, yum. That was a weird noise. <laughs>